Hi everyone, I'm back with another haul video for you guys and this one's a little bit of this and a little bit of that from here and there. Um, let me start by showing you what I got at Hobby Lobby the other day. Um, I love my envelope punch board. I know I've mentioned it and I was really looking forward to getting some more of these and Bona um, hi Bona, you are so awesome. You really rock. You and your videos are great. And I love how you show all these different boards and how well we can utilize them. Um, it's good to know when you're spending the money. Um, so I got this, um, the gift box punch board. And as probably most of you already know, it's $19.99. I used my coupon, so it was, I think, $11.99. And I'm sorry for the glare. Hi, you see me. <laughs> um, and so I haven't used it yet, but I am really looking forward to using it. So it should be really fun. I know with a 12 by 12 paper, you can only make a four by four by four box, but I was really hoping I could make bigger ones, but I guess you need bigger paper too. So that led me to think, I wish someone would come out with bigger papers now for all these punch boards and different things. It would be really fun, wouldn't it, to make like a six by six box? So we'll see if that will happen down the road. Um, and then I got um, from my local scrapbook store, which probably is kind of boring, but I got four, four rolls of score tape and they are uh, three half inch and one quarter inch. So I got these and I paid $5.29 for my quarter inch and I paid $7.79 for my half inch. Um, it's the only place here that I that I found it locally. And so the Stamp Retreat is really a great store and they're carrying a lot more stamps. Like she just ordered Sherry Baldies, the Besties and all that. So I'm really excited. So I got that there because I want to make some minis. And... Um, what I also got there is the Simple Stories um, Vintage Bliss. So I got the chipboard pieces, and I love this paper. Oh my gosh. I think Simple Stories is connected to um, My Mind's Eye, aren't they? I don't know. To me, it seems very similar, and I love My Mind's Eye. But I love that smile big, give love, be grateful, laugh lots, and live simply. So really looking forward. I want to make some cards in a mini with that. And then I got the um, Vintage Bliss, the six snap pockets. And these are in different sizes. And again, really, really cute. Um, these were $5.99. The chipboard pieces were $3.99. That's again from my local scrapbook store. And then I got the Simple Stories Vintage Bliss. And I found, actually I found the paper at Hobby Lobby, so it was great. So $5.99, but half off was uh, $2.99. So I got two of these. And I'm sure you guys have seen this, but let me flip real quick in case here. I'm sorry, I have to do this sideways the way I've got this set up. But really, really cute, you guys. Um... So you get, I guess, two of each. Isn't that pretty together? Oh, would that make a beautiful card, wouldn't it? That too. <laughs> and there's one of my new favorite colors. And look at these butterflies. More butterflies and then those that little flower print on the distressed wood. And I love that one too. They're all really pretty. And there's just some alphabet with the numbers randomly in there. And that's pretty, the gray with the polka dots. Of course, we all love the bingo cards. I know I'm just crazy about them. And I got a few sheets of the 12 by 12. I forgot to pull that. Isn't that pretty? Um, and there's just your distressed wood. And then your chevron. And then this one here has the... Um, let me get to focus better. There we go. Little butterflies kind of faintly in the back. And then this is like school line paper when you're learning to write, which is great. I find the older I get, the more I'm into the vintage when I was growing up stuff. Like all the October afternoons, I'm just going crazy over their papers right now. 
bringing back all those great childhood memories, right? And here's some regular writing paper, which will be a lot of fun. And then the green, and that's just got the grid. And then that's it. So really cute. So I got two of those because again, I want to do some cards and a mini and I got um, several of the 12 by 12s for like the covers and such. And then, um, I ordered, um, from Peachy Cheap. I ordered this a little while ago and it's the October afternoon, make it merry eight by eight pad. I won't show you this. Um, I think it's older, not old, but, um, I think everyone's probably seen that. And then I forget what I paid for. For this I think it was like $20 shipped I want to say um, and then you get the brads love them super cute just reminds me of growing up in the 60s and 70s and I I just love that when it takes you back to all those fun times so here is a includes 12 double-sided postcards on a sturdy uncoated cardstock Again, really, really, really cute. And then, um, let's see. I think that's, let's see. Oh, I'm not sure if I shared these. I might have, but I'm going to show them to you real quick. I got two Amy R. Stamp sets, and this is the Handy Christmas Greetings. Again, look at this, the way she did the Noel and the Jolly and the, I just love that. I really, really am loving her stamp sets, and I can't wait to get more. And I'm so glad, again, my local um, stamp store is carrying all kinds of great stuff. And this one is the Autumn Sentiments. And again, just really, really cute. Um, and then from um, Tuesday morning, I got this um, 14 pad here. Crate paper, perfect for Valentine's Day. Um, I just got this recently. I look at the hearts. I'll just flip, look at those, really cute. Um, the globe, that's cute too. And they're one sided, these are chevron, little hearts, one big doily. And then this has all 14, 14, 14, which will be real cute to cut apart and put on cards. Um, your gray X's and O's. And the banners. Stripes, diagonal stripes. Isn't that pretty, you guys? Look at those flowers. Oh, so pretty. Big chevron with the green and cream. Red and cream. Isn't that beautiful? Again, I'm loving this color lately. I still, my pink is still in first place, but this is right up there as a close second. Um, isn't that cute with all the envelopes? I love it. And then the last one is a chocolate connoisseur. And it's like an order for chocolate. So really, really cute. So that was um, $2.99. And then from my um, local um, chocolate bakery place where I get like my Peter's Caramel for my turtles and I get um, the big baking Giardelli, you know, all that kind of stuff for baking and candy making around the holiday time. They have all these bags, and I'm just a sucker for bags. I love bags. I love boxes. I love, you know, I just love it. So these are cellophane bags. Um, it says C2. It's four by two and a half by nine and a half. You get 25, and they were $2.99. So I have a lot of sizes, but not that one. And then I thought this is a pretzel bag. So this is a... Um, Three by eleven, you get twenty-five for two fifty. So I don't know, you know, can use them for all kinds of fun stuff. And then they have these. Look at these, you guys. This is a cookie bag. You get twenty-five for a dollar. And they're five by one by four and a half. And that's where I get them at ABC Decorating Supplies on 28th Street and Indian School in Phoenix. There's their phone number. So if you live in the area or whatever, go in there if you like this kind of thing. So I got four of those because they were a dollar. <laughs> you know, why not, right? 
So, um, and then at my local um, fabric store where I go, where I get a lot of my flowers for a really great price, they had um, these burlap pouches. And I think these were, I can't remember how much they were, but I just thought they were really cute. Just kind of a cream off, just slightly off white um, with the tan things. And you get, um, they're four by five and you get six of them. So these will be fun to alter. So again, I apologize. I can't remember how much they were. And then I think that that is it. The one thing I forgot to show you from my Michaels haul is I got this new, um, let me cover you up and move you. So I got this, let me move my Diet Pepsi. I got this here from my desk from Michaels and I, I've seen a couple other people and I've had mine for probably a month now or actually it was when they had 60% off. Maybe it was like three weeks ago. I don't know. And so I, um, you know, I have, I think 51 or 52 Copic, something like that. And um, so not a whole lot yet, but they fit in there nicely. It's a lot easier for me to see what I have. And it's, it's real nice here on my desk. So I thought that was great. The doors, drawers are great underneath. And then when I get more Copics, I'll see if I can buy this insert here that slides out with all the dividers. And if not, I'll see if hubby can make me another one. So it'll be a while before I need any more storage. I'm trying to buy my Copics, you know, two at a time or so. Um, I generally do it when I have a 50% or a 40 off at um, Hobby Lobby and I kind of got my wish list going. So a little at a time. So I think that's it for now. I hope you guys are all having an awesome day. Thanks so much for watching and we'll talk to you soon. Bye.